Hello, good morning to everyone. Welcome to Tech Easy. Today, in this video, when I am using WordPress on my local host through XAMPP server, see here XAMPP server, when I try to upload a new theme, it has shown the following error. I'll read it for you. Post content length byte section, something like this. This is upload error. How you can fix this? Actually, I fixed this issue. So now I'll be able to upload the theme successfully. So you just need to use two lines just two lines in the notepad file we need to set the upload size we need to increase the upload size then this problem will be fixed automatically so how you can do that open the xamp server here while it is running under the apache server click on the config and click on php.ini okay So this will open the php.ini notepad and just search for this one max upload size you can use control F and you can search something like max upload max size something like that. So when you search for this you will find this one okay just keep the comments here with the hash and Use these two lines. I'll uh, drop these two lines in the description. Check for that. You can copy and paste in this uh, notepad file and click on the save. I'll explain what is this exactly mean. We need. We are just increasing the maximum upload file size to 1000 MB and post max size is 1000 MB. Once you are saved, save this notepad. The changes won't be affected immediately. You need to stop the server once, both MySQL and Apache, and start them again. Okay. I restarted the both the instances, and I'll refresh this page. Here. Yeah. Now try to upload the same theme, which you got this previously, this error. Post content uh, length of this one, something like this. Now try to upload the theme. Uh, just for the testing purpose, I have downloaded a dummy uh, theme I don't know what it is exactly but I got this from the internet just for the testing purpose I'm not going to install this or something like that now these problems won't be occurring means we are increased the maximum upload size so that you won't face this error anymore please do comment if it is successfully completed or the error is fixed for you and please do hit a like so that it may be others it may be useful for others too okay if you do have any other questions regarding the xam server and local wordpress please do ask in the comment section and thanks for watching have a nice day